Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Drive TV. We're in the house of Drive. Where else would he be? It's either the house of Drive, the gym, or on the ride, right? All right, so, guys, I hope everything is going good. I hope you're having a positive day, a positive week. Everything is going good in your life. And if it's not, hopefully, today might be something that might help those problems. So, today I want to talk about committing until it becomes a lifestyle. So, when you commit to something, let's take your marriage, for instance. When you commit to marriage, right, you're committing to that person that you're going to be with them forever, right? And it basically be, turns into a lifestyle. You're living with that person. You're raising a family with that person. You're building um, a future with that person, you're building an empire, right? Now it's basically a lifestyle. It's not even a commitment anymore, it's a lifestyle. Let's take um, starting a business, okay? How many times have you guys had an idea to start a business but you never did it or you started it and you gave up because you didn't see the money coming in or um, it's, it got too hard? right? But if you committed to it until it turned into a lifestyle where it actually became, it actually made you money, it became an actual business where you actually make a living off of it, you would keep doing it, right? But you have to be committed to that stuff, okay? When you have a plan, if you have an idea, if you have a woman that you want, anything in life, you have to commit to it. You have to want it all 100% in, okay? Let's take dieting, for instance. You knew I was gonna bring that up, okay? Dieting, if you commit to a diet, if you commit to a goal that you want to become healthier, if you want to lose 20 pounds, if you commit to it until it becomes a lifestyle, you won't even look at it anymore as a diet. You'll simply look at it as it's a lifestyle. And that's what I mean when I say it's a lifestyle, guys. It's a lifestyle. It starts with committing first. You have to commit. And once you commit to it and you actually prove to yourself that you can do it, not anybody else, to yourself that you can do it, then it becomes a lifestyle and it becomes part of your life. And it's who you are. It's what you represent. It's what you stand for. When you walk into a room, it's the presence that you bring, okay? It all starts with commitment, okay? And everybody can change. We can all be the same and change, okay? It just starts with one person. If one person commits, and makes the change, that leads to somebody else committing and making the change, okay? And that's why I call you guys legends, okay? That's why I call you guys, let's become legends by the end of the year, okay? Because when you show somebody that you lost 20 pounds, guess what's gonna happen? They're gonna wanna know, how did you do it? How did you do it, Ryan? Well, I did this. And they're like, okay, well, it worked for you. I'm going to do it. And hopefully they commit too to where it turns into a lifestyle. And then all of a sudden, they're changing other people, right? It's no other than a relationship, okay? I have friends that are married, that have been married for 10 years, 20 years, you know, 30 years, right? And that to me is badass. I'm like, man, what a, not, what a lifestyle now. But the commitment at first is what it takes. And that's awesome that people can do that. You know what I mean? So, and it's no other than starting a business. It's like me with the drive clothing. I had to commit to it. I had to say, I know it's not gonna happen overnight. I know I'm not gonna make a living from this overnight. It's not gonna happen. Because if that's the mentality you already have when you start a business, dude, you're already, you're already with the, in the wrong mindset. You shouldn't even be thinking about that. When you start a business, you should be thinking about how is this going to help people? How is this going to better people? 
not worrying about how much money it's going to make you. You know what I'm saying? You can't worry about that. you got to learn to commit first. And once you commit over and over and over and over again until it is your time and it turns into a lifestyle, then you will never make it. You have to commit. It's all about committing, guys. So, start rethinking some things in your life and think about how many things that you said you wanted to do and you never did it because you couldn't commit to it. Whether that be a business, getting higher ranked in your job, becoming a manager with it, whatever, getting another job because you hate your job right now. You talk about it every day, how you hate your job, how you hate where you live, how you wish you had this, how you wish you had that, but you're not willing to commit. You have all the ideas. You already said, man, if I just go and apply over here, I know I could probably get the job. You know you said that in your head. You know you have. We've all done it. How I do it too. I'm no better than you guys. I say it all the time. I think of all kinds of crazy ideas, and then I don't do it. You know, and it's just because we're human. You know what I'm saying? We're human. We're not perfect. You know what I mean? But if you want something more, if you want something better for yourself, dude, I can tell you from experience, you have to commit. Everything that I have in my life and everything that I've done is from committing. Straight up. There's, there, there's no bullshit behind that. It's because I committed and I turned it into a lifestyle. And that's what I made it. That's what I decided because that's the life that I chose. That's what I wanted to do, okay? This is what I want to do, okay? Because I committed to it. I'm not going to give up. I don't give a fuck how fucking, how much work it's going to take to get it out there. I don't give a fuck. I'll go out there. And I still go out there, day in and day out. So, and I put the work in here. I show you I put the work in here. You know what I mean? I put the work in there. I put the work in the kitchen. Okay? Because you ain't getting me, baby, without the kitchen. All right? So, let's get the shit together, guys. All right? We're coming to the end of March, and now we're going into April. Remember I said, we're already three months in. Now we're four months in. We're going into our fourth, January, February, March, going into our fourth month. That's three months in, baby. You, hey, we were two months in earlier. Now we're three months. Are you still in the same place you were on March 1st? Are you still doing the same thing that you were doing on March 1st? Hey, I'm hoping you're not. I'm hoping every single one of you guys are living a fabulous life and everything is perfect for you. I, and I hope you're happy. That's all that matters to me. So as long as you're happy, that's all I care about. But if you're not happy, you need to take this shit serious and commit. Finally commit to whatever it is that you've been thinking about over and over and over again. How you know, if I just commit to it, I know I can do it. Fucking do it. Let's get it. Let's fucking go. It's 2018. We're making motherfucking legends. If you want to hit me up, you want to talk about diet plans, you want to talk about first form supplements, you want to talk about some business, email me at chad at the driveclothing.com or you can reach me on Instagram, Mr. 12. Hit me up, get at me, leave a comment below, give me a thumbs up. All right, guys, let's go, let's do this together. All right? Okay, I'm here for you. Just reach out. Just say something. Don't be scared to ask. Just fucking ask me, man. I'll tell you. And if I don't fucking know, I'll fucking tell you I don't know. You know what I mean? I'm not perfect. I'm just, a, I'm just another fucking bearded brother, guys. All right? So, let's go. Enjoy. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Until next time, signing off.